In this tutorial, I'm going to show you a quick and easy way to create indicators with EA Builder. Let's create a simple indicator based on the stochastic oscillator. This example can act as a starting point for creating your own indicators. Let's attach the stochastic oscillator to the chart. You can see a blue line and a red line oscillating between the market extremes. The blue line is the so-called baseline and the red line is the signal line. When the baseline crosses the signal line, we want to display an arrow to buy or sell. So let's do it. Create a new MetaTrader 4 indicator and call it Extreme Turns. Add Condition, Stochastic Oscillator, the indicator buffer is Baseline, Cross is Above, and again Stochastic Oscillator. But here we choose the signal line. OK. Now click on this icon to customize display style. The indicator type is arrow, arrow up, the color is blue, the label is buy, and the arrow will be drawn at the candlestick low. We leave it as it is. Click OK. Now let's create the red arrow for sale. Click on Indicator Buffer. And here is one smart button that will do the job for you. Create the opposite. The condition changed to crosses below. The arrow is down, in red, and it will be drawn at candlestick high instead of low. We are happy with what we see, so we can move on. In the Common tab, we can choose whether to draw the indicator in the price chart or as a separate window. We leave it in the Chart window. In the Alerts tab, we check Audible Alerts so that we hear a sound and see a pop-up message every time a new arrow appears. In Inputs, we add Audible Alerts so that we can turn it on and off. In the Source tab, the source is generated very quickly. The code is human-readable and well-commented. It does not include any extra files or advanced object programming, so it can be a very useful study aid, but you don't need to understand it. Now you can either download the file and install it on your platform, or copy the source. Do whatever is more convenient for you. I will copy the source, open Meta Editor, create new, Custom Indicator, give it a name, and the settings do not matter because they will be overwritten. Finish. Control A to select all, delete, and Control V to paste. Compile it. It was successful with no errors. Go back to MetaTrader and our new indicator appears in the navigator on the left. Double click. We see it has one input audible alerts set to true. OK. We can check that the arrows are drawn correctly as the oscillator lines cross. The problem is that the arrows overlap the price a little and we would like to correct this. Go back to EA Builder, click on the plus sign to extend condition and lower the value of the candlestick low to move the arrow lower maybe 10 pips lower. But to make it universal for all currency pairs and time frames, we will subtract the indicator average true range. Click on the magic icon and the rest is done quickly. The red arrow is drawn at candlestick high, plus the average true range. Copy the source, paste, compile, and now it looks better. But there are too many arrows when the market is in this flat area. We will make additional conditions to display arrows only at the extremes, 
beyond the overbought and oversold levels represented by the horizontal lines at values 20 and 80. Go back to the Indicator tab, add Condition, Stochastic Oscillator, Baseline, Is Below, Value, 20. Create the opposite using the magic button. Edit the automatically created condition. And replace 20 with 80. Copy the source. Paste. Compile. Now the arrows only appear in the overbought and oversold zones. There is still room for improvement. In a trending market, you may want to beware of trading against a long-term trend. You can use the trend indicator from our free bonuses to clearly see the trend. And for exiting, you can use your own rule based on the number of pips, or the colored CCI indicator. In the next videos in this tutorial, I will show you step-by-step -step how to create a profitable expert advisor based on daily breakouts and other useful expert advisors. I will start with a simple strategy based on moving averages. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you a quick and easy way to create an expert advisor with EA Builder. Our first expert advisor will be based on a simple moving average crossover. We will cover some important issues while developing the expert advisor. Create a new MetaTrader 4 strategy and call it MA Cross. Add condition, moving average, with period 5. Crosses above, Moving average with period 20. It is important to know the difference between is above and crosses above. Is above is a continuous signal, which means that the order would be opened every tick as long as the moving average with period 5 is above the moving average with period 20. This would lead to many open trades. Crosses above is an instant signal, which means that the order will be opened just once at the crossover. Click this magic button to create the opposite conditions for sell order. Now the opposite to close the trade. Here you can choose either is below or crosses below. Both are correct, because even if you choose the continuous signal, once the trade is closed, there are no more trades to be closed. Create the opposite order to close short positions. In the Common tab, there are some additional options we will look at later. In Money Management, we will use a fixed size of one mini lot or 0.1 standard lots. We can check audible alerts for each order and error sending order. In inputs, we will add the trade size. The expert advisor is ready and the source is generated. Copy the source. Go to your platform, open Meta Editor. Create new expert advisor. Call it MA Cross. The settings do not matter because they will be overwritten. Select all, paste, compile, no errors. Now we want to backtest it to see how it works. View Strategy Tester. Select the expert advisor we just created. If it doesn't appear in the list, restart your platform. Select the EURUSD symbol, 15 minute time frame, 
every tick model. Choose the date interval. Check visual mode. And start the tester. What we see here is that the order is opened and closed multiple times in the same place. That's not what we want. The problem is that the price moves up and down. The moving averages cross upwards and downwards multiple times inside a single bar. We will fix this by simply checking the option Next Open Trade After, let's say 5 bars, and the minimum trade duration 5 bars. The expert advisor will wait at least 5 bars before opening the next trade or before closing the open position. We can run the tester again to see if it works. This time, we see one buy order at the moving average crossover. The order is closed at the next crossover. Sell order is opened, and so on. Another option to deal with this is to send the order only when a new bar opens. Add condition, bar opens. Because this signal is instant, we need to change the crosses above to is above. Create the opposite order. And we will do the same to close the trade. We don't want to open a trade for every bar as long as the condition is met. Therefore, we will limit the maximum open trades to one. It will not open a new trade before the position is closed. Copy the source. Now, because we are sending orders only at the bar opening, we can use the fastest model, open prices only. In the next video, we will start creating a more useful expert advisor based on daily breakouts.